my fellow book addicts, Megan here, and time for my July TBR. So, as you might be able to see from the background, I have officially moved. We're still in the process of unpacking. So, things can be kind of crazy for, you know, background and all that fun stuff. And, um, I'm going to be doing a lot of experimenting with lighting. So, probably going to be changing this background and setup a few times before I find something I like. Alright, so June was an okay reading month. I was doing really good for a while, and then this move happened. So, that kind of affected my reading a lot. So, a lot of books on my July TBR are going to be from my June TBR. So, without further ado, I am going into my July TBR. So, the first two books in my repeat TBR are the first two books in the series, and they are The Red Queen and The Glass Sword by Victoria Victoria Aveyard. So I'm very excited to be able to read these two back to back because when I first read The Red Queen, I really, really did enjoy it. And I'm so mad at myself for not getting a review filmed for this right after I read it. But life and its craziness happened, and yeah, story of my life. The next book in my TBR is The Battle of Scandia by John Flanagan and this is book four in the Ranger's Apprentice series. Now preferably I would like to get further into this series. I have all but maybe one of the books on my shelf over there but because I'm trying to keep my expectations for myself low I'm just gonna be happy if I read this one. Next, I have The Death of Deldath by Michael J. Sullivan, and this is book three in The Raira Chronicles. The next few books are actually new books. Yay! Different books! And this first new book is called Hungry, and it's by H.A. Swain. I think I'm pronouncing the last name right. And I remember I got this book a while ago. Like, I can't even remember exactly when I got it, but it's been one of the books that's been on my shelf for a while. But from what I remember about the synopsis, this pl takes place in kind of the future. Food is kind of obsolete. There's some sort of patch or medication or something along those lines that the people take so that they are not hungry. Like, it suppresses hunger. So, you know, no one has to grow food anymore, no one has to buy food anymore, but I believe that pill, patch, whatever they use has stopped working and people are getting hungry and there's no food. So people are not going to be too happy about that. Next I have Winch Kill by Kate A. Borman, I believe. And I can't really remember anything about this book, but from what I remember, it sounded really cool when I read about the synopsis so it became kind of an impulse buy and it's been sitting on my shelf for a little bit and I want to get to it because it's been staring at me for the past couple of months and for some reason I just haven't picked it up but hopefully this month shall be different. Plus look at that cover. I don't know why but that cover just seems so cool to me. And last but certainly not least I have Age of Myth by Michael J. Sullivan, and this is book one in his newest series, Legends of the First Empire. Did I say that right? Yes, The Legends of the First Empire. So yeah, I'm really excited to get to all these. Hopefully I can get to all of them. I'm um, not going to get my hopes up too high because reasons, but yeah, let's see how I do. So that's really it for my July TBR, and I'm really excited to get to it. So yeah, that's it for this video and I hope to see you guys next time. Keep on reading my fellow book addicts, keep on reading.